Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon. A couple of items up here ready to be made. And a power source. Uh, right now, Gabby is on the hunt for mushrooms. Um, so that way we can, you know, make the stuff. Whoa! Oh, that's it. This just covered a spider. Okay. Thought it was something cooler. But still, cool. <laughs> gold. We need spot of gold. I don't know how I discovered a spider cave. I'm above ground. Because you're a witch. I guess. Oh, uh, I did just find source berries, which is a... Uh, that's a good source of food. Magic. Sure, that's a magic mod. Also not a bad source of food. Ah. Yeah. I think they're about the same as, uh... Ooh, we're gonna need more flint. Sweet berries. We got enough, but we want the pulverize to be extra efficient. So... Uh, so we're gonna need more flint. More oh, berries. um... There's probably some gravel in the I chest. I converted all the gravel to flint. Okay, um... I'm sure there's more down in the mine somewhere. Yeah. Grab some of that while you're down there. Thank you. No, oh, I'm not down in the mine. I'm above ground looking for those mushrooms. Uh, aren't they underground? I'm above ground. But aren't shrooms <laughs> underground? Oh, you can find them above ground. Like, uh, okay. I was, ho I was hoping to find like a uh, magical forest or something. Arch. All right, so one of you. One of you. Un piston. Two copper gears. Two redstone flux keels. Guess who has a pulverizer? Nice. And then. Now we just gotta power it. Oh! Oh, good. We have enough copper. I was gonna say, we need more copper, but luckily we have just enough. I forgot the Gorman Dynamo needed a copper gear. Uh oh. Luckily, we have just enough copper. But, uh, we're gonna be low on copper. Uh, sleeping might be an issue while I'm away. Oh, yeah, you're far away. I don't know if, uh... Well, good luck, sweetie. Oh. Uh. Well. Try not to die. Yeah. That is the plan. All right. So, let's see. Sweet berry. Whoa. You can, like, 8 x eight sweet berries with a little bit of wheat. Oh. Yeah, the cookies. Uh -huh. Unfortunately, we don't have much wheat. Yeah. But that can be fixed. <laughs> I got two. That's enough. Oh, shoot. The witch found me. Oh, yeah. No. Do not poison me. Please. Please. However, witches can drop glowstone, redstone, mushrooms. Oh, <laughs> I, did, I did not know that. I believe they can. I I I don't know. I thought it was just like most common uh, potion ingredients. Um, I don't know. Okay. Ah, uh, that did it. So let's see. Uh, good. We have two chests. So far, this adventure is not going well for mushrooms. Uh, it's not going well for anything, really. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but we got Fuck a pulverizer and a gourmet dynamo. Uh, I'm currently making some more gravel so we can flint it up. Because nice. you can use flint 
the pulverizer to increase the primary aug and auxiliary modifier, though flint also makes it cost a little more energy. Let's see, we're also going to want a little bit of iron. Because I'm going to see uh, if I can get lucky with those three eggs and make ourselves a chicken farm. What do chickens drop besides eggs just on their lonesome? Do they drop feathers or anything? Yeah, they, they drop feathers and then their meat. No, no, I mean, if you just leave them alone, do they do anything besides eggs? Oh, no, just eggs. Okay, I'll make a quick drawer then. I thought you meant if you slaughtered them. No, no, no. <laughs> I, they don't even drop eggs if you kill them. You gotta be nice to them. Yeah, to yeah no, they don't drop their eggs that way. God, I'm used to having Slash Home available to me. Do we need onion? Onions? No, we got onions. Whoa, you're armored. Oh, that's not you. Hi, Juju. Hmm. <laughs> This mushroom adventure. Oh, it sounds like he is the good. I keep planting sweet berries instead of eating. Oh my gosh. I just planted five sweet berries. Do you want a different food source? <laughs> I have onions on me too. Maybe eat some onions, because we, we got onions. We're fine. We don't need more. I just need to learn to look up and not be going up a hill while eating. <laughs> All right, we got three eggs. We got two eggs. We got one egg. We didn't get lucky. Mm. Let me see if I can lure a chicken in manually. Once we get yeah, that might chicken, be your best bet. Game. There's a couple of chickens near us. Yeah. Uh, you can use the mini map to find them. Uh, I know. Yeah. That's what I do. That's what we do. Ooh. I Peter. have found a red mushroom. We need we need brown. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Dangus. Okay, but I also found a beehive that's got a lot of honey. So I'm gonna smoke it and grab it. Do we have shears somewhere? Are they on you? Uh they are on me, yes. We got or doubling, I'll make another set of shears. Okay. And then how do you make a fire? Let's do. Oh, um, campfire. Yeah. There it is. There's the recipe. We sh uh, I think we might need more wood for that, so I'll just, like, chop a tree. You know what's the one thing I really love about botany pots that you don't get in many other mods? What's that? One block tree farms. Yeah. That's that's like the one thing I wish. Like I wish there was like bonsai trees where you could just grow a tiny little tree and get wood out of it. I thought there was a mod for bonsai trees. I'm sure there is. 
There's a mod for everything. I don't know that it's in this pack. <laughs> oh, I don't, I don't know it is. And a piece of coal. Right, let's make a camp foyer. Alright, I'm gonna do the responsible thing, and I'm gonna put a campfire directly underneath a tree. Yes, that is responsible. <coughs> Yay, honey! I kinda wish we had the mod that lets you get more health when you try new foods. Oh yeah, I know. That'd be really useful for us right now. Yeah. Uh, do we need potatoes? Pam's harvest craft, which adds so many foods. I like Pam's. It's a fun mod. Yeah. Do we need potatoes or cabbage? Yes, both. Okay. I found a village, and I am robbing them of their potatoes and cabbage. Okay. I approve. Come on, little chicken. I promise I won't trap you forever in an eternal well of torment. There's no blood magic in this pack, I think. I I do like how You're so? how like I, you will spawn okay. beings from the darkest depths of reality in an eternal well of suffering just to like power your lava gen for blood magic. Hey, I found beetroots too. What the heck? Oh, beetroots. That's good. We could have yeah. used beetroots for something. I think that'll give us a good a good food source for us, but not necessarily for power. Right. Well, I also know Gigi was asking for. Yeah. Do we need a burning stand? Why not? <laughs> All right. So we got one chicken. So we will slowly get eggs. One chicken. Um. Salad. What was the salad we were looking at? There's mixed salad and then there's... So yeah, we can make a mixed salad now. That'll be good for us. Like, for personal food. We just okay, so in vanilla, I spent ten hours looking for a jungle. I just found a jungle. Nice. Hopefully that doesn't mean I'll spend 10 hours looking for a rough mushroom. I found some melons. Ooh! That means we're actually one step away from fruit salad. We just need pumpkins for that. Oh, uh, I think I passed by some pumpkins. Uh, I, don't remember, I don't remember where they were at. Oh. Uh, so like, we have pumpkins. We don't need those. What about cocoa seeds? What about what seeds? Cocoa seeds. Get those. Get those. And some, some stuff to plant. With them. Oh, uh, we need a jungle software. Yeah. How many different types of plants are you bringing home? Uh, that's a good question. I have carrots. I have beetroots. I have okay. melons. Cocoa. Oh, so, so beetroots, how many normal plants? Like the ones that just right-click. Beetroots... Uh, cabbage. So that's one, two. I think that's it. Alright, I have prepped two new rows for that. Okay. And then we will, uh, we'll do something special with the, with the other ones. I could not get a jungle sapling. Dang. So I just got one. I Yay. just have to complain about it first. God, we have a lot of plant life. Yeah. That's a good thing. We'll have to expand. Yeah. But, uh, that do be how be. That could be something that we do. Just, well, uh, I mean, eventually we're going to close it up. So. Well, I was thinking we just expand and flatten everything out. <laughs> Make a big flat area. For the rod of terra firma. Mm. I what? Batania. In this pack? Oh, uh, no. I just like, I looked at that earlier. Dang. Batania's fun. 
There it is. Oh, I just realized something. We cannot grow flax in the phytogenic, or in, in a cloche. We need a phytogenic insulator for that. So, I mean, admittedly, we don't really need flax for much. It's just string. Some pumpkins. Good, good. It's all coming together. Yeah, so I got the, the two rows at the end for the beetroots and the the not beetroots, the cabbage. The not beetroots. Yes. That's Which that's all I'll refer to. Many things. <laughs> that's the only way I'll refer to cabbages now. And and then we can just slap the other two somewhere else. I got a hoe. If you need it. You're a hoe. I said right. I got a hoe. Oh, you got a hoe. Yeah. You know what? We'll do. We'll do the me the melons and the pumpkin. Or no, you you just got melons, right? That's the only weird plant you got. I got pumpkin too. Oh. And you know what? Let me clear out each. And side. I also got cocoa seeds. If you want to count that as a weird plant. I'm not sure we really need to grow cocoa seeds for much. Like, what do we use them for? Make regular cookies. <laughs> I don't know what what else. I don't know what modded things you can use them for. I am never lucky with egg drops. Now let's let's check the uses of cocoa. Um, you can make chocolate you... pie, brown dye, cookies, chocolate cake, chocolate Easter egg, which you used to make an egg basket. Interesting. An Aphrodite, Aphrodite serum. You can use it to make hot cocoa. And you can use it to make chocolate. Wow. Chocolate? Chocolate! <laughs> uh. Alright. Um, let me sort my stuff. And while we're waiting on you to come home, let's look at Immersive and Coke. So we're going to need 36 bricks, 36 clay, and some sand. Oh, for Coke oven? Yes. Luckily, I prepped. Oh, nice. Yeah, so we just need 36 sand, which we have 32 of. Oh, four sands won't be that bad. I think I picked the wrong direction. Oh, I found bamboo. What is bamboo even good for? You can make scaffolding. What kind of scaffolding? So scaffolding, um, what you can do with it is you can climb scaffolding. Okay. You can place it from the bottom. Okay. in order to go higher. And it gets destroyed in one hit from the bottom. It'll destroy the entire scaffold. Okay. Seems useful. But you know what else is yeah. useful? What? Flying. Oh, yeah. I mean, flying kind of negates most usefulness. It's scaffolding. Yeah, I don't think but... it's that much use for bamboo, but grab it anyway. Why not? Yeah. I don't know what it's used for in... Modded. Uh, modded, yeah. Yeah, probably not as much. <laughs> that should be enough. I found a broken portal. Nice. That means there's obsidian there, right? Yeah, but this is quite far away. And I have no way of mining up this obsidian. Yeah, yeah, no, we'll, we'll save that. We'll, we'll handle that later. Okay, egg. Turn into another chicken. Dang it. I might automate 
<laughs> the eggs between episodes, like shooting the eggs into themselves. Okay, so that. Alright, so we got ourselves 30 or 27 coke brick. Now we just need two iron and a piece of string, which luckily we got flakes. And we also just have string besides that. All right, and I have the hammer. The hammer. We no longer need to smelt um, coal in, or wood into charcoal. Have we done that at all yet? I don't think so. Well, we don't have to do it again. I found coal pretty early on. <laughs> yeah. We got lucky in the coal department. Although, speaking of which, do we really... Whoops. Do we really need okay. coal from up here I, I found a mushroom forest. Yeah. They have giant brown mushrooms. Can we get regular brown mushrooms from that? Yeah, you just break them apart. Oh, do that. Uh, do we have much use for coal right do now? Do we do we coal? need a bunch of brown mushrooms? Is the question. Uh, grab a bunch, and and we'll automate them later. Wait, we can brown. Yeah, we can we can put them in a cloche. I think. You might want to check that because yes, I know yes, they don't can. grow like normal. Okay. You can grow them in a cloche. Then I'm just gonna get. I'm gonna break apart one giant mushroom. We don't have cloches yet. Yeah, I know. So we might, I mean, it's, it's a good source of power. We probably want to, because I don't want to use coal for power. That's lame. I don't either. But... So so let's get that green bean pie. Just like old Pappy used to make. Do we have a way to store power? Uh, We have a pulverizer and a dynamo. So no. Well, yeah, no, but uh, okay. Speaking of which, I should make some more power. 14 brown mushrooms from one giant one. Nice. There are more giant ones here. I'll just mark this area. Sounds good. It's a, it's a little bit of a trek, but... Uh, Not too far. Uh, my coordinates are 539, 2157. So it's like 2,500 blocks away. Okay. Ish. That's a bit of a... We'll teleport eventually. I, I feel like... Our mushroom situation will be taken care of before teleportation's a thing. We shall see. We shall see. We I think we'll have closures before we have teleportation. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we, we got our first more coke. Oh, nice. Yeah. I am on my way back with those mushrooms. On my way. Watch me run into another mushroom forest on my way back. Because I'm taking a different path back. <laughs> that would be funny and actually pretty useful. I did like a circle. Or, like, I went out and, like, into a spiral. So, uh, it is possible. <laughs> you know what I should do? I should probably chop down some treeage to, uh, so I can make a dwarf for cobblestone. Because we will need that. Oh, yeah, for sure. Well, I mean, we're, we're, I've actually been pulverizing a lot of cobblestone, so we don't really need it yet. But, uh, we'll need it at some point. What does it pulverize into? With cobblestone? Yeah. Turns it to gravel, sand, and flint. And that, that'll come in handy. Like, in the gravel, and then the gravel pulverizes uh, gravel, into the sand? Gravel, yes, with a chance of flint and sand. Oh, I see. I see. Yeah. Climb in the mouth. Climb your mountain. 
back in the jungle. Hopefully no lions get me. Are there lions? No, it's a, it's a joke because in the jungle... I don't the know lions if there's lions tonight. in Minecraft. I don't know what's been added. Well, lions sleep in the jungle, you see. I see. Yeah. All right. Uh, I'm just gonna stick all our all our ore chunks in the pulverizer and just let it do its thing. Because we've got. I always thought that song was weird because whenever I think of lions, I think of like the savanna. Yeah, I get you. The savanna's not a jungle. <laughs> yeah. Honeycomb. What do we do with honeycomb? Uh, apparently, we I don't can know. Burn it up in a tea. I don't know if lions can sleep in jungles or sure if they they're can. like. I mean, I'm sure they can. I mean, I don't know if lions if like natively are in jungles. I want to say no. Yeah. All right. But uh, so we got some some good old fashioned ore doubling going on right now. Uh, we, when you get back, we'll have all the ingredients we need to make green bean pies. Um. I wish. All right, let's, let's stick some peanuts in there. Hmm. So we were talking about, uh, automated farms of vanilla earlier, right? Yeah. You can make what's called a KFC. What do? So, uh, you have chickens oh, who yeah, like they create a... Farm. Yeah, the the eggs get dropped automatically into, uh, yeah. into a contraption that once they grow up, they'll be burned up, and then yeah. the cooked chicken falls down. <laughs> it's a yeah, KFC. I, I built that. It's not too difficult. It's easier with mods, but it's not that difficult. You yeah. need a little bit of lava. Uh, and you can nice do, stuff. you can do a similar one with like pigs and uh, cows, but, but that's not, not fully automated. Them. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I guess you could do. Well, no, you couldn't because you couldn't feed the cows. Yeah. I was just thinking you could fully automate uh, wheat. But there's no way that you can give the cows to wheat. Yeah, because they don't pick it up off the ground automatically. Yeah. Um, okay. So, what, the last thing I think I'm going to do before the episode wraps up is I am going to automate turning our eggs into... Uh chickens. That's what I was looking for. So for that, yeah, I didn't think... Yeah? I didn't think it'd take me all episode to get back to base, but uh, <laughs> I am just now hitting that village. Wow. Do we have a village near our base? Near-ish. It's like okay. a thousand blocks away. I can mark it on my map. Hmm. We're gonna need some more. We might have enough. Are there waystones in this? I don't think so. Because if there were, there is a chance we could get teleportation before it closes. <laughs> yeah. I do not think there is, though. Uh. Ooh, can we put rotten flesh in the. No, we can't. Flesh doesn't count as food. Not, not enough, I guess. Same. All right, so I'm gonna need. You can't give the machine hunger. Oh. You can't. You don't want them going on a rampage. <laughs> <laughs> hunger for the sweet, sweet flesh. <laughs> You gave me flesh, I eat yours. 
So let's make a pipe wrench. An item point. Ooh, you know what I need? I need a clock. Wait, we have Project Red in here, don't we? How do I make a timer? Okay, we need some circuit plates for that. Okay. Uh, then we're just gonna need... Yeah. Yeah, okay, okay, I can work with this. We're going to have so many vanilla furnaces when this is over. Oh my gosh. <laughs> just because it's like, it's just so easy to just spam vanilla furnaces to get stuff done. <laughs> You'll be the death of us. We're going to wake up dead next day. Did he just get his first stone pick? Probably. Okay, so then we need... Two, three. Man, I am like, I'm level eight. You put an ocean in my way. I did. I didn't. I didn't go across. Oh, it's not an ocean. It's a lake. <laughs> Slight difference. <laughs> it, it didn't render in the other side of it yet. It just looked like ocean. You know the uh, fair, the lake that enough. separates the continents. Fair enough. I just I got attacked by a pufferfish. Oof. I got attacked by a pufferfish. Oh, that's scary. Pufferfish are dangerous. Yeah. I right, guess who's got a timer? A timer? Ah! Yeah! Yeah! Well, Wilden Stalker. Oh yeah, those are scary. Can't They'll just come out of nowhere, swoop down. Yeah, really did. We should focus on armor at some point. That takes effort. That does take effort. a lot of iron. Oh gosh, Dingus dispenser face the right way. Wait, is there a... Uh... There, uh... There's not. I was gonna say flex, uh, flex and fuse armor. What is like the flex, flex plate? Oh. That's usually my go-to armor. I'm not sure what sort of armor. To uh, well, on. eventually we'll have unlimited iron through create. Well, yeah, but I mean, just sticking with iron armor is fun. I mean, it's 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 adequate. Not for the T eight hundreds. Well, they're they coming to drink our blood. So, what? Well, I... yeah, they haven't been invented yet, so I think we'll be okay.
help. All right. Uh, we need to lure a chicken back in. But we are now 35 minutes in the episode, so we'll do that. We'll have that done by next time. See you guys later. Bye.